In this tutorial, we'll learn how to create and post AR payment batches. There are three steps in the process. One, create the batch. Two, enter customer payments. Three, close the batch. Beginning at RPM Central, select Manager Tools, then Accounts Receivable, then AR Payment Maintenance. The AR Batch Payments screen displays. This screen displays all existing open batches. You can use the filter options to view closed batches and also batches created from POS. To create a new batch, click the plus sign. The Batch Payment screen displays. The Batch Description displays. You can change it if you want to. Entering a value in the Batch Total field is optional. This amount is used to validate that all payments have been entered with the correct amounts. If you enter the total of your payments here, then RPM will keep track of the difference as checks are posted, and the Difference field will be zero when you're done if the entered amounts match the Batch Total field. Total your checks and enter the amount in the Batch Total field then click Create Batch. RPM displays the Batch Entry screen. Enter the customer number or use the customer search to find the customer. RPM will display the customer's account information. Enter the payment date. RPM defaults to today's date. You can change the date but it must be a date between the last statement date and today. Enter the check number and amount received, then click Save. RPM adds the payment to the grid and updates the batch totals at the bottom of the screen. Note the difference at the top of the screen. Continue entering payments in this manner. When you are finished and you have verified that all of the information is correct, you are ready to close the batch. Notice that the difference is zero because the batch totals match the total of the entries we've made. To close the batch, click the Close Batch button at the top of the screen. RPM prompts you to confirm you want to close the batch. Click OK. You have now created and posted an AR payment batch. There are some important things you should know about AR payment maintenance. 1. Currently, the only payment method that can be selected is check. If a customer is paying by credit card or other means, you must enter an ROA through point of sale. 2. The payment date is used to determine whether discounts are assumed when applying payments. If the customer's terms state that payment must be made by the 10th and today is the 12th, if you use today's date, payment application won't assume a discount. If you use the 10th as the payment date, it will. 3. Discounts are not included in the payment batch entry. Discounts are taken when the payment is applied. 4. RPM allows multiple users to post batches at the same time. Each user can create multiple batches each day, but one batch must be closed before another can be created. 5. Payments can be deleted or changed until the batch is closed. However, payments can be applied and unapplied regardless of whether the batch is open or closed. Also, a batch can be deleted if necessary as long as it has not been closed and none of the payments have been applied. 6. All batches must be closed before end of day can be processed. Therefore, we recommend that you close the batch as soon as you have confirmed that it is correct. 7. Closing the batch puts the funds into the safe for deposit. These funds can be deposited with other funds or separately, depending on your store's procedures. Please view our tutorial on how to apply payments for more information on how payments and discounts are handled.